Hello, everybody. It's Slushy, and welcome to Sinister Smile. So let's get into this. So it's kind of funny. My good friend, Arctic Conquest, he created a thing a while ago called Sinister Smiles. And it's pretty cool that there's a game now called Sinister Smiles, even if it is an indie game. Where are we at? My dogs have toys that look just like those. Day one on the job site, I have two men that are helping me with this project. We only have three months to get the escape room and arcade up and running. We are thinking we will start on the characters first. Joseph. Okay, I gotta be honest. The mechanic where when you grab notes, the camera moves while you're grabbing the note, and then it moves when you press back, and then you have to click the screen again in order to go back into the game. And also my mouse is still showing up on the screen. That's weird. That was very loud. Are you Mr. Smiles? Yes, he is Mr. Smiles. That's his name. Go in. What is this? Is that a can of water? No problem. I'd love to have some water. Give me some more. Give me some more. Thank you. The more water, the better. Water's good for the soul or something shit like that. I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know anything. I don't know much of anything. I know some things, but I don't know much. Okay, I know like I know like this much, but other than that, I'm lost, man. I'm a lost fish in the sea. Okay. Oh, this I'm gonna assume. I gotta say that that noise is a kind of a wake up call. It's extremely loud. Very loud. I thought this would have opened this, but I was very much wrong. Apparently it opened something else. What did it open? Did it open something out here? Did it open the door? Now why would you put the I feel like that's nonsensical. You put a you put a you put a lever for this door in the vent. And it doesn't even open all the way. You still gotta play limbo with it. Hey smiley, I don't find this shit funny, okay? It's not funny. What kind of TV show are we watching here? Is that 3D TV or is that a loudspeaker? Either way, it looks stupid as fuck. Okay, that, that that's definitely locked. How about a key? Terrific. Let's open this up. Oh, God. Smiley, smiley. Yeah, smiles all over the place. What is that, an old arcade machine? Machine? Did I call it a machine? I'm weird. Okay. There, there, there are levers all over the place. Also, why does it have... Are you smiley, sir? Are you a smiling smiler, sir? S sir? You want some help with that? Sir? You good? You? Okay. I know it's disrespectful to walk upon a dead body, but I get a sneaky feeling. He's probably not dead. Oh, he's still there. Never mind. Maybe he is dead. I'll take another water. Thank you very much. Can't go in there. Oh, a lever. Terrific. I'm having concerns about this job site. Two days, one of my workers disappeared. Objects seem to be moving around and misplaced. I talked to the owner and he jokingly replied, well, this place is built on top of an insane asylum. I feel like I'm ready to walk away from this job. What is so funny about being built upon an insane asylum? Again, I hate the clicking mechanic. That's stupid. Okay. I don't like the darkness. Can I go in here now? How about a water? Is that a beer? What am I even drinking? It's not even labeled. It just says push, push it, push it, push it real good. Oh, the guy's gone. What did that open? Did that open this? Am I supposed to go in the vent? I'm going to assume I'm supposed to go in the vent. What's with this weird light inside the vent? Is that even normal? I don't think it is. Oh, great. More. I was kind of thinking it might have been sparkling water because it has bubbles on it. Engineer. Wow, he's quite the quite, quite the crafty son of a bitch, isn't he? He's not just a mascot. This isn't just a mascot horror game, guys. This is very much just a game about a, a lonely engineer in an empty factory or empty arcade or something like that. I don't know. I can't. Hello. How you doing? <laughs> I can't fucking follow the story. I don't know, man. Don't ask me for. Don't ask me them kinds of questions. I don't have a goddamn idea. Apparently, my man just phased through the vent door because there's literally nothing down there but a vent door, so he likely just went straight through it. He doesn't abide by the laws of physics. 
Smiley. Yes, we've established his name. What am I doing? What was... Okay, I can't even look up now. Okay, what what is going on with this game? Okay, now my mouse won't leave the screen. In order to turn, I have to grab it with my right... What? What, what is happening here? Why is this game so broken? Why? Why do I have to... Do I have to play the game again? Okay. Is it, are you kidding me? So the game literally breaks if you don't beat that game properly? Is that supposed to happen? If not... You might want to fix that. If it is supposed to happen, then pardon me. Negative two. Gotta give me some water. Okay, give me, gotta give me some suds. <laughs> oh, weird guy is gone. Okay. That's strange. Hello? What is that? What's down here, huh? Can I just drop into the abyss? You can, but it kills you immediately. Okay, gotcha. I'll try to be a little bit more careful not to fall into the deep black hole. What do I do? All there is is deep black Oh, it's like a vent or something. Oh, God. I get bad feeling about this. Okay, it takes me here. Where is here? Where is here? Oh, give me... Give me some of these juicy, juicy suds. Yeah. Thank you for that. I don't like that. Oh, oh, oh. No, not doing it. Fuck that. He's right behind me, isn't he? I kid you not, I couldn't have walked any faster. What the fuck, dude? This game is kind of bullshit, man. Besides all the issues, it's kind of wonky. I'm trying to move as quick as I can. This is literally as fast as I can move. Where do I go? I don't know where the fuck I'm supposed to go. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? This game is such bullshit, man. It doesn't make any fucking sense. What the fuck? That doesn't even make any sense. I was crouched down. That doesn't... Oh my god, I'm getting pissed. I am getting fucking pissed. This game and it's fucking bullshit, man. There's so many, so much shit about this game that pisses me off. That's one of them. Is that it? Am I finally alive? Or are you gonna try some more bullshit? What is this? I don't know what the fuck this is. Oh my God, come on with the stupid mouse thing. Today I went to the lunchroom at 6 p.m. Yeah, I don't really give a fuck. Oh my God, dude, fix your fucking game. It's broke. Fix your game. It's a mess. What is the fucking code? How am I supposed to know what the code is if you don't even give me a pattern?
A E H A. One, five, eight. Clicking. Oh my god, fix your game, dude. Seriously, fix your goddamn game. It's a broken mess. I'm trying to be nice as possible, but this game is fucking just balls. It, it literally just is. It, it's so bare bones, too. Like, I'm not one to ever... If any of you... If you have ever seen any of my other videos, you'll know that the one thing I hate the most is negativity towards anything. But this game is ass. It's complete ass. It's broke. It's a broken mess. And ironically, the one game I play that does have a pro ha does have a drinking mechanic, it's this. It doesn't make any sense. Why why is this even included? What does this have to do with anything? It doesn't make any fucking sense. None of this makes sense. I'm losing my voice from the fucking stupidity. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't really give a fuck anymore, man. Seriously. What do I do now? You're kidding me, right? So now you're turning it into a platformer. Literally one of my least favorite things in any, any game, period. A platformer. Wow, it seems like this was almost a direct mission to pit to piss me off or something. Are you telling me I have to go back? Great. I swear to God, man. This game is so annoying. In every sense of the word annoying, this game is that. Oh, this is the most annoying game I think I've ever played. <laughs> wow. Please don't make a chapter two. Please don't. By the grace of God, do not make a chapter two. Or here, how about this? I'll leave something even better than that. If you do make a chapter two, please fix the issues that I have with the game. I will gladly pay, play a chapter two if you fix the issues. For some reason, I get the feeling that there will be no issues fixed. But if you do fix the issues, I will retract everything I've said here and I will come back and play chapter two. Oh my god, there's not even barely any story to this game. The gameplay itself is just so boring. The the setting of it is so drab and just empty. It doesn't have a how, how who do you expect to come to this arcade with just gray? It's it's just a gray walls and gray floors. There's no color to it. It's like there's no creativity put into it. it just doesn't look like an arcade. It just looks like a random facility with a bunch of vents and a staircase. And apparently a bunch of hanging bodies. I, I don't, I don't, man, I, I know that sometimes I just kind of go with the flow, but it's hard to, especially when you have a miserable experience like I've had with this game. Oh man, I'm so glad this is over. Again, Dr. Goldie to the developer. I don't mean to bash your game as hard as I, as I am. It's just, it's broken, man. Like there's no reason why. You should have to continue to click. For one, my mouse should disappear. I'm not mad about it here, but whenever my mouse is appearing during the game, whenever I'm moving it around, and like if I interact with something, I have to like triple click it in order to interact with it. When I was putting in the combination, I had to click each of those numbers about three times in order to put them in, which is some bullshit. That should never happen. Uh, not to mention, after you do that, you got to click outside of the screen a couple times in order to get your mouse back in focus. Oh, man, there's so many issues. Just please, if you make a chapter two, please, for the love of God, fix them. Oh, my God. That was Sinister Smiles, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.